Jackson Barbie T on 95.1 WAPE. We've been taking some phone calls, and now we have uh, the mayor from St. Augustine. Yes, the Honorable Miss Nancy Sykes Klein. Thank you so much for calling into the show. All right, so, you know, we've been talking about the best food places uh, for us to try out. Like, what would your suggestions be whenever it comes to going to St. Augustine? There are amazing restaurants along Anastasia Boulevard. I live in the neighborhood, so we eat a lot at Blackfly. We love to go downtown to see our friends. You've got Drunken Horse, which is wonderful, the Columbia, which our visitors enjoy. We have Alton area, which is down the plaza, which is really incredible. Gypsy Cab back on the island. Well, and then there's Urban Asado over there on the river. And, and how cool is it that, like, the mayor is going into your restaurant and trying out the food? <laughs> and I feel like that's pretty cool, right? Oh, yes. we. My husband and I eat out all the time. We love to try the different places. It's a small town. You know, we live in a pretty big area, edges of St. Augustine, but the actual city is pretty stable population at about fourteen to 15,000 people. So it's still a really small town. So I've got to check out the St. Augustine Light Tower. So Dex doesn't believe in things being like haunted and he doesn't believe in ghosts or anything like that. I so know. Is it really haunted, and have you ever experienced anything there? Well, my personal experience, you know, I was very involved in the restoration of the Lightkeeper's House, acquisition of the Lighthouse, and opening it to the public. Spent a lot of time working over there in the tower, in the Keeper's House. And I did hear a lot of stories from the locals about things that had happened during the restoration of the Keeper's House. Personally, when I was in the Lighthouse, I did hear children's voices laughing. I had to walk back up to the top to double check to make sure there was nobody in there. Interesting. Yeah, that's the only experience I had and it really shook me. You know, it was it was an experience I won't forget. But yeah. nothing negative. There was no negative vibe or anything. In fact, there's nothing but a wonderful, loving vibe over there at the keeper's house in the lighthouse. So they're happy ghosts. Good. We could take yeah. Dex over there. Yeah. <laughs> or or it could be some kids who are just kind of playing around and like, oh, let's mess with the mayor. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I'm just saying. So, so Barbie told me that you have a degree in geography. Is that correct? I sure do. So can we do a quick test whenever it comes to geography and ask you one question for you and one question for Barbie? Because she's she's pretty decent with, with geography, too. <laughs> oh, my God. Well, okay. Stop me now. Why? Okay, here we go. Uh, so for yours, what state has the Golden Gate Bridge? Oh, okay, okay. California. California, that's correct. See, I knew that one. Okay. okay. Barbie, <laughs> your question. Uh, what is the capital of Florida? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> um, uh, Barbie, we're just specific class. You, you, can, you can give her a hint if you would like. In the panhandle. It's in the panhandle. Do you know what, what part Panama that is? City. Panama City. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> <laughs> um, Give me one more. It's not Miami. I know that. It's not Miami. Um, uh, begins with a T. Starts with a T. Starts with a T. Native American. Is it Tuscaloosa? No, that's Alabama? not. Alabama? No, wait, wait. <laughs> It's, it's tele, Tallahassee. Tallahassee. Yeah, that's Tallahassee. What it was. There you go. I, I knew that one. I meant that. Thank you, Mayor Nancy. I appreciate your help. <laughs> Listen, thank you so much for the time, and we can't wait. I'm I'm looking forward to checking out the the outlets that you guys have there, and all of the beautiful sites that you guys have. And, and thank you so much for calling in. Absolutely, you will love it when you come and visit us. You will uh, truly love it.